Tower of God, episode already. five. The episode, yeah, already, dude. This episode was jam packed, as every episode is for the most part. But uh, we can start at the very beginning with Kuhn and how he's the most tech. He's mm -hmm. a very tactical fighter. We all notice he likes kind of sh like showing off in a way, but it was more to show like, hey, because of Bam Bam Bam's in this scenario, I want to show Lizard Girl. Don't fuck with us. Like we're we're good. We're strong. Which yeah. I like that from Coon as well. I thought for sure, like when he, <laughs> two things, he pulled the his bandana out of his hair. I thought for sure that was a part of his hair. That 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 threw me because I was like, oh, what? That did. wasn't his hair. How the hell was it staying? And then he put his hair up. I thought it was gonna be like. I'm putting my hair up. I'm about to get serious. Going series of unfortunate events. Going to figure this problem mm -hmm. out. And then the other people turned on him. I was like, wait, what? Yeah, I, pl I planned this. This was the signal. <laughs> what? <laughs> All right, let's get wait. Let's, 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 let's wait. We're for getting us. there. That's what happened. So, that's what happened at the beginning. <laughs> that's the one. Yeah, the he, stuff, he makes though, a first. bunch of. Like you, you yeah. learn, you learn that he can copy. Which is why you you talk you talk about how oh he always gets racked the chocolate bars or well, he's copying the chocolate bars over and over. It makes again, a lot of sense giving now. Giving them to rack, which is why now you're seeing why he has unlimited chocolate bars. So we now know his thing can bring in and store its people to objects inside the box. Now that's why you remember he was saying oh you have a very large luggage you're carrying, and then when he was trying to go through yeah. the barrier, and he was like the box was struggling is because he had yeah. them in his bag. Which now everything like that makes sense. I thinking fully ahead, like it wasn't like, no, you guys weren't the first ones I met. I met other people down on their luck during this and said, Hey, this is dumb. I'll bring you guys farther and farther, help you out, and yeah. uh just do this little favor. How long was that exam? How long was the first exam? The first exam minutes? went like twenty minutes, maybe thirty minutes. That's that's a guess. That's what that's what I thought. I know I'm I know the timing about that threw me a little bit because like in 20 minutes he found three people to save and convinced to be in his bag and then he went and did the shenanigans. It might be more than 20 minutes. We're just showing it out like we don't have a verified time. At least for as far as I remember there was no verified I, time. We just went by oh it feels like 20 minutes it happened. I, we do not really know. I thought I thought there was a time limit in what the beginning because remember we had to reduce the 400 to 200. No I think it was just reduced it until, time, it, until it's over. Just reduce it until there's 200 left. Oh, yeah, you're right. It was. It was just reduce it to a certain point. Okay, then never mind. Then, yeah, we have no idea what how much time it took. I just thought that was kind of odd because to myself, it felt like 20 minutes, but the that's just because like it's it's yes. condensed. Yeah, it's just because it's condensed by, you know, us. So, right. Whoops. But that's still a, a very interesting effect that his bag has. That'll become in handy, I'm sure. More than it already has down yeah, the line. That's, uh, it's very, like, because... He's very good with the knife. He's very good with the bag, which he did say. I, I forgot how he worded it, but it was like, he was like, Bam's like, oh, you have like a one of a kind item almost. He's like, uh, not really type of deal, which means there's more items kind of similar to this. He might, he probably has special items stored within the bag. I would, I would bet anything. Boom. And, but then that round's over. So we go to the final round and, uh, we see some finally, I'm so glad they had the mass badass girl. In this because like i thought to myself so many of these people just really need to be badass that we have no idea who they are we had no explanation they just badass to be badass yeah and like and she, she was, was she was doing work she she had the best fight sequences of the whole time because rack got kind of sidelined with that one dude that was a like a fifth his own size <laughs> yeah who could, who could kind of keep up with them but he still got you know trapped when rack decided to head, yeah when rack decided oh, okay time to end this boom head butt I know he didn't use his spear. He's like, I'm going to do this with my fist because you are only using fists. So Rack does have uh, some semblance of honor, but the mm -hmm. mask girl was getting work done. She literally ended everyone's whole careers, dude. Like, I'm going to end your whole career until uh, the other girl came in from the masked group. Psycho, psycho chick? We don't know her psycho name. Psycho chick. Yeah, we know. So, right. She's definitely kill crazy she's definitely kill crazy yeah she reminds me of the girl uh from not even she's she's a yandere let's be honest she's she's a yandere she's not too cute but she's a yandere that's what she is let's be honest I, that's what she I, seems to be yeah i i thought it was interesting on when they were fighting those two 
at one point the girl has her staff and she's holding up yonder a girl and the only thing i could think of is why are you letting her stand on your spear flip and flip it over and smack her because she's like yeah they do that thing where everyone's like oh i'm so badass i'm gonna balance on your weapon but if you're a smart enough fighter like in berserk you twist that around on them to like get the edge up you know you don't just stop you don't just hold her up why are you holding her up flip and flip the staff and smack her with the opposite end or something it might know? just be animation. I don't. It know. is. It's a cool yeah. shot. It looks yeah, cool. It's, it, it's, a, it, it's. It was meant to be a cool shot. But that just means that girl weighs like either she either weighs nothing, or that other girl's freak is strong. That girl probably weighs ninety pounds, but that's still ninety pounds you're carrying. But I mean, I assume there's a way to be super strong. Oh, to be I'm, like muscular. I'm sure. I know that was just like a dumb monkey thought in my head. I was like, just flip the, smack her. What are you doing? But when she hips people. It draws blood. Like yeah, she smacks she's not... people on the backs of the head, and ooh. But uh, <laughs> anyway, we have uh, Rahal or Rachel, whatever you want to say, how you want to say her name. I'm pre- it's pronounced Rahal. It seems like Rahal. I thought they were saying Rachel. No, they're saying like go back. They say they have they say like Rahal. They do that. It's like uh, how we call bam. It's like how we call bam 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 bam, bam and not bomb. <laughs> he will always be bam 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 that is He'll the only correct bam, bam, way bam. to say that there's no other way to say bam bam bam's name but uh but we see yeah. rachel or rahal come in and he starts she's protecting bam 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 it's like oh coon's like i don't know who these guys are i didn't convince them or bribe them to like help, yeah. help us and bam bam bam's like rahal is that you is that you she's, she's not responding at all until uh let's just uh Crazy Yandere girl gets fucked by the mask girl by breaking her heel. She comes for Bam Bam Bam. Or before, yeah, she comes for Bam Bam Bam. Rahal gets in the way to stop her. Gets mm-hmm. fucking just done very easily, very quickly. Just, I was very surprised <laughs> by that. And crunch. crunch. <laughs> before the next one, next week, Bam 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 uh, gets off the throne mm-hmm. and dives to save the day. He reveals his main character power and then time gets stopped and then he uh the lady that stops the time prevents him from murdering uh tights girl yeah because he according was to gonna. the instructors he was literally maybe the power of that's in the show shinichi yeah he's made of shinichi like, which he I became wanna... he became it yeah and we need to talk about that later on after we go through the overall because i think that's the most important thing that we've seen so far is <laughs> is that ability uh so, yeah that whole com literally the most like when it comes to things of the show that dialogue between the two instructors was the expanding the world type of deal yeah and they're still being very vague coy and vague and it's like oh some things blah blah, blah looking off the screen oh character we haven't met yet you're such a dick you know like <laughs> stuff like that you know but uh and no one won no one technically won the the bonus game because the crown got destroyed. Yeah, Bam Bam Bam's too strong. I guess. And then they gave him a three-day break. Uh, everybody's doing their own little thing. I love that. Kuhn is watching over Bam Bam Bam. Rack is training. Everybody else is just kind of standing around. And then at the end of the episode, Rachel officially, quote-unquote, officially reveals, reveals herself and says, I am I am Rachel. I have a favor to ask. Scene end. And all I could think of at that point was we knew it was you. Like it, we, we've known for like two episodes. It's definitely you. What? Yeah, I, we all, it is. It yeah. is that moment of like, we know it's fucking you. We know it's you. We know it's goddamn you. We know. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. But, but, and so next episode, we'll figure out what uh, that's all about and why she isn't responding to Bam 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 or acknowledging his existence minus trying to save him the one time. Hmm. So then let's go to Best Girl Yuri before we get to the main thing. Oh, yeah. That I want to talk about Best Girl Yuri. Because yeah. she's still, she is with a group of people now. It's not just the navigator, Evan. She's with a group of people. It's she like added, a swole, swole, she, swole, 10 foot guy just like, oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, Ra- Yuri. Yuki, we are. <laughs> <laughs> Yuri. Yuri. Uh, we gotta, we gotta fucking go. He's over here. It's Yuri's fine like, if we go that way. And he's like, I thought he was going to be a big dude, time. but she's this big compared to him. It's great. Dude, I want to see Evan next to that guy. That's what I want to see. Oh, my God. And then we have Gamer Dude in the background who's just busy on his Switch. 
Just going crazy. Dude, he's trying <laughs> to beat the next level of fucking Mario Kart. <laughs> trying to beat that 200 CC. It oh, ain't God. play. It ain't play. Oh my God. And then, but uh, at least we know they're still around. They're doing stuff. Yeah, we know uh, they're. Oh, what, oh wait, no! Uh, Anak has Anak has the Black March. Anak was holding Bam 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 sword. Sword. Was he? Yeah, Anak was holding Bam 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 sword. I'm fully confident I saw that. All right, oh. time out. I'll, I'll, we'll be right back and we verify. Go back. Yes, she is is holding the sword introspectively. So I'm wondering if she's gonna give it back. Or if she technically, <laughs> or if she's gonna be like, no, I technically won. You didn't win. But she I never, didn't he never lose. agreed to the bet, though. I know, but I mean, she just wants to be a thief. She can do it, but I feel like the test administrator will interfere if that's the case. I don't know if he'll care enough to be honest. With you. He, he he seems like he care because he could have told uh, the other, not getting too much in that. Well, yeah, let's get in that now. He told the other administrator to saying, "Hey, I know you're the main administrator, but uh." Bam, bam, bam. Is there's no unusual tease here? It's all normal. Even though he literally said, "Bam, bam, bam, we got a monster here," like on episode two. He literally is uh, made of their power. Slash could interrupt and be the thing that they're trying to avoid. Slash is an acquaintance of Rachel, which is a direct violation of the tower rules, which we learned mm-hmm. too, uh, directly by uh, Hedon. So he's letting that continue. So I'll be. Curious to see how Hedon messes with things after that point. I think Hedon's that... going to be fine with it because Hedon allowed this to happen anyway. Well, he allowed Bam Bam to go met. through. He allowed Bam 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 to have a black march. Hedon does does not care about this part. Hedon would not interfere at all. With well, this no, they were in different knew... testing grounds though. They were in different yeah, were... testing grounds until this moment. I so still they... don't, I I still don't think Hedon will care. I think Hedon will don't literally think? not care. Nope. He okay. because he knows what Bam Bam Bam's goal was anyway. So he's that, just like, that's oh. true. I, mean, I or he thought, yeah, you'll probably find her dead <laughs> somewhere. But she's supposed. To, is she, my question is because is she another world or two? Or do I still sometimes? I'm still thinking she's manipulating Bam Bam Bam, and she feels horrible about it. I I gotta imagine Be- that it's something along those lines. Because literally, she why Hydra identity? Why do any of this? Because if you, this is the person you know, she had 100. percent find him she's using him she knows that he's a monster well like, and of strength. she knows about his feelings for her she knows he'll he like she would do he knows how much he, so especially after you diving can't be to save her life. Yeah, yeah you can't be that dense that you're like if i just ignore him maybe he'll stop talking to me or i think maybe no it's too, like, either she was manipulating him to get something or she doesn't want him to get any involved with her any further than he already is to like save himself well it's too late for that sister yeah, it's you, too late for that motherfucker yeah if you had literally just explained what you were gonna do and then did it he probably wouldn't have jumped into the portal to come after you and now we're in this mess well so uh just bam, and bam could bam and bam could disrupt the whole order of the tower and god knows how big this tower is let's talk about how nah, we don't even yeah. don't, did they say how many floors there are because we're no. all yeah they have until Wait, we're at the beginning like we're at the i don't know i'm just go 100 is like the base let's just let's just say there's 100 let i know it's might not be the right answer but even if it's a hundred, they're on four goddamn three. Bam, yeah. bam, bam. It. Aaron, next week I might come back having read the web novel. I cannot guarantee I'm not going to read it or not. <laughs> I think the main point of this episode and the thing that I think is extremely important is when he says bam, bam, bam is made of their magical power that uh, Shishini, I think it's called. Yeah. He's directly made of it like when he said or at least he converted himself into power which if you take that literally he is if he converts himself into their power his power is then limitless so therefore he has no upper limits based on what i just heard so he's the most op character that can't control it like He's got to have some kind of direct relationship to the beings that actually rule this world slash interact with it slash mess with it in some way because he's made of their spirit of their magical force. You know, it's kind of like Superman. He has no upper limits because as the more solar energy he absorbs, the more powerful he can become. If he steps inside a sun for 15 minutes, he can move planets and galaxies with ease. You know, it's just because he has no limit. Same thing with if 
if we apply that to this and Bam 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 is literally made of their magical energy, then he has no upper limit. And that's ridiculous. But he can't control it, obviously. I am fine with that because he can't control it. And you don't know how many other monsters, other irregulars there are. So it's not like he's overpowered to, at the moment. At the moment. He's definitely OP. Yeah, he's OP. But I like to see Bam 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 as a wounded puppy. Someone found a wounded a wounded puppy. Oh no! Let me explain. Let me explain. It's imagine you're Aaron. You're walking down the street and you see just a bad puppy that's almost dead, or just not dead. It's just very sad. And you help it. You bring it back to life. And the puppy's very nice to most people. But if anyone fucks with you, it will murder anybody. <laughs> Such as that's what we see during this episode. Is Rahel was the owner. She was getting injured. Then we see Bam Bam Bam, the wounded puppy, show its fangs. He ruptured her eye. Did you see that? He literally, it the, her eye kind of like went, <laughs> oh, that was so gross. I thought she just got her like face scratched or something. You know, like it cut the mask up. No, eye removal. Oh, that's, that's gross, but cool. Dude, Tower, I, of, I, Tower of Simp is the greatest show. This is such a great, not the greatest show. This is a, not my favorite show even of the season. I will, I will say it right now. This is like my third favorite show of the season with Love is War being number one. Ooh. Love is War is still number one, boy. Bus. Same thing. Bus. Same thing with the show we're not even reviewing. I'm, it, it's still, I love this show. I think this show is going to be an epic story when we get to the, like, as we go along and it will become one of the best shows. Both Love is War is season two. Got it. I'm already, I'm already invested. <laughs> but anyway, not to get dwell on that. Uh, I think we talked. We got most of the stuff. It's about twenty minutes long. Uh, let us know what you think, guys, in the comment section down below. I mean, most of you re read it, so <laughs> yeah, you already know what's happening. You're just watching two idiots debate and discuss what could be happening. Yeah. <laughs> if we if we get it right, don't tell us. I mean, you know, they're going to tell us. There's going to be that one person that tells us. And who? I mean, you don't have to look at the comments. I do. I don't care if someone tells me anything. Oh, I don't look at the comments. It's too, it's too, it's too risky. It's too risky, man. I've already had one major book series ruined for me by by people. My cousin read the whole series in the last two weeks since the third episode. I think he started reading it, and he's, oh, he just texted me today before we were filming this. He's like, "I caught up," and he told me something spoiler already that I'm not gonna tell you. I, oh. I, I know two spoilers, and I was like, "I don't want to know anything," and I don't want to know anything. He's like, "I won't say anything." Anyway. I'm like, "Why did you tell me that?" It's not a big mm -hmm. spoiler or anything. It's a very tiny, tiny spoiler. But I was like, no. why'd you tell me that? But it didn't, it didn't really affect me. It doesn't affect my enjoyment of the show at all. Oh, like I'm, I'm, here for the, I'm here for the story. Like, that's it. I'm here for the story from beginning to end. I like the surprise. I like the surprise to him, man. He can't do that to someone. That's mean. Yeah, I'm not like I'm not here for the surprise. I'm here from beginning to end. It's... I'm sorry, guys. Uh, we were just ranting there. My computer is squeaking so much went down the rabbit hole let us know what you guys think about the episode did you enjoy it did you like it uh are we kind of on the right path maybe maybe not i don't know uh aaron any last words eight out of ten <laughs>